Hello, I'm Marlene here with The Beacons End, where we play as Samuel, a solitary lighthouse keeper on the remote Blackstone Island. A dream job, am I right? <laughs> He's tasked with the daily routine, trying to forget his haunting past by maintaining the lighthouse beacon to protect passing ships. Samuel's unaware that underneath the island lurks something very sinister. <laughs> Hopefully it doesn't have tentacles. Though I get the feeling it does. This game did open with an HP Lovecraft quote, so I think we kind of know what we're getting into. But yeah, let's find out. <laughs> Already enjoying the look of the- oh! The fuck, is that a body? <laughs> oh! Don't know if I'm gonna like what Samuel is hiding from <laughs> and his sinister past. This is clearly a body, right? Also, not the best accommodations here. Got a lot going on in this little shack. Get rid of your wife! What? <laughs> okay. But where? Not exactly a task I'm too keen on completing, but that's what Samuel wants to do, and that's what Samuel's gonna do. Where? I don't know. Oh, this weather. <laughs> Gorgeous. Are we just gonna put it out in the water? It's a pretty sweet island, though. Look at this up here. What have we got over here? Oh, yeah. Looks like we're <laughs> throwing it over. Task successful. Mm. <laughs> Splash the beacon's end. By Cap Crow Games. All rights reserved. Okay. That's one task down. What's next? Turn on the light? Looks like we need to. Especially in this weather. You definitely don't want to be slacking on your lighthouse duties in a freaking storm. Light the lighthouse. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. Ooh, what's over here? What's this? What did I just- what- what- <laughs> what am I holding? Is that coal? I do love this feather though. Also, why is there a tree right here? <laughs> it's just our dock tree. No need to overthink it. Turn the light. Light the lighthouse. We are on it. I never get tired of going up to the tops of lighthouses. <laughs> is, is that a stove? Is this how we light the lighthouse? That's like literally a stove, right? Uh, is it done? Yeah, it's full of the lever. Oh, 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 looks good. I guess we do it with fire. I guess that was cool. And I guess... Go to bed? Maybe? Maybe I don't know what else we're gonna do. We had dick all to do in our house. And a freaking chair and a bed. That was it. No longer have any company. Anymore. R.I.P. To our wife. <laughs> I guess it's one side. <laughs> oh, I don't know what we're supposed to do next. Oh, day one. Okay, wife is gone. Light the lighthouse again? Presumably? You know, like lighthouse, okay. Do we need to get more coal from the dock? Oh, no. Maybe. Uh. Oh, wait, hang on. I guess it's just all over the place. Is that more fuel? Yep. Okay. Let's go fill the stove for the lighthouse. Yeah, pop it in. And uh oh, another, another night successfully lit up. <laughs> Thanks to yours truly. And back to bed. Quite the exciting life we have out here on Blackstone Island. I think it was called. I don't actually remember. Let's go back to our shack. What's going on right here? Um, that's definitely not lightning. What is? <laughs> what is happening right here? You know what? Whatever, let's just go to bed. I'm ready for day two. <laughs> if I could handle the excitement anyway, I'm not sure. Yep. Yeah. Let's go light that lighthouse again. Ah, sweet monotony. Oh, is coal is... Enough. It needs <laughs> uh, that might be a problem. I think I threw away the only flesh I had. My first night here. 
find something to feed it. I will try. We got here a little well. Huh. Um. Oh, hang on. Is there something right here? Oh, just boards. Makes sense. Oh. This is just always fucking raining here, isn't it? Lovely. Oh, ooh, I see an arrow marker. <laughs> Perhaps there is some flesh over there. Just what uh, a rat? Oh. Oh. Hopefully that'll do. I mean, sad. Because it was still a living thing, but could be worse. Could have needed more. But... Also, feed it. Feed the lighthouse. Things are about to get weird, pretty sure. Let's light the lighthouse. Sorry, little guy. But at least your sacrifice is in great service to lighting the lighthouse. Very important. There you go. Clever. Oh, I'm getting good at this. Look at that. I did that. <laughs> I lit that thing. <sighs> Alright, what time to turn in? My favorite time of the day. Like, for real. I love going to sleep. It really is the highlight to most of my days. And no weird flashing lights here this time. Uh, yeah, get in. Uh, day three. Everything still looks the same. <gasps> oh, we got a new wardrobe thing? What? Oh. It has changed in here. It also sounds creepier. Very familiar, actually. Can we go back in? I want to listen to that some more. No. Definitely heard that before, though. I like it. Oh, does it hunger? <gasps> something alive? Oh, I don't want to put something living in that stove. I find something alive. A, a, an alive rat? Oh, no, no, no. Oh, it's fish. How did a fish get up on the, <laughs> on the dock there? Impressive. Looks like a koi. Okay. Once again, I realize it's a living thing, but could be worse. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Are the walls changing in here? I think so. I think it might be living. Hmm. Alright, there you go, lighthouse. Hopefully it satiates you. <laughs> okay. It would appear, yes, it is satisfied. It is definitely changing in here, for sure. It's like veins on the wall. Yeah, pretty sure this lighthouse lives. I feel like I can hear him breathing. Well, that might be in my head. I don't know. But yeah, back to bed. <laughs> Nothing like a good night's rest after feeding the lighthouse. Day four. Oh, it's gone now. I wonder if I could have done something with it. I clicked it like crazy. Nothing happened. <laughs> so I tried. Uh, oh, it's over here now? The clock turned. Oh, it did too. Oh. Let me get that sweet music again. So you just feel relaxed. Until that happens. Alright, let's go. We got a lighthouse to feed. I think it is in our best interest to keep it happy. More flesh. Living or dead this time, Lighthouse? What would you prefer? I guess just more flesh. Any flesh will do. Okay, I can probably arrange that. Ooh, what do we got this time? What is another fish? Oh, a seagull! Why is it all bloodied? What, what happened to it? Alright, we know the drill. Oh, it feels more veiny. That sentence felt gross. <laughs> Alright, pop it in. Pull the lever. Lighthouse satisfied. Uh, okay, yeah. And to bed. Day uh, five. Okay, the clock's back to normal. Nothing else looks weird. Oh, the chair's gone. <laughs> I think 
think we might be going crazy. I mean, <laughs> we probably already were, considering this game started with us throwing our wife's carcass in the ocean. Hang on. No requests? The lighthouse is already on. Ooh. <gasps> oh my god. <gasps> oh, there are tentacles! I knew it! I knew there'd be tentacles, and still they <gasps> startled me. Can we get closer to them? Oh, it moves. It moves with us. Let's try to get in the lighthouse. Ooh, that gave me shivers. Oh, we can go in. Can we go back out? No, okay, maybe I shouldn't have come in here. Oh, even the stairs are fading. <gasps> oh, I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. Yeah, I hear you. I know. Yes, my flesh. You know what? Fine. You can have it. Is that a sword? What is this? Wait, what is it? <laughs> oh. Oh, damn, I am such a good lighthouse keeper. <laughs> the ultimate sacrifice to keep the lighthouse happy. You gotta do it. You gotta do what it wants. Oh my god. <laughs> Not very efficient at it. <laughs> Are we? Oh, we're still alive? Oh my god, we cut off a limb? Oh shit, okay. Oh my god. I thought that was gonna be it. But I guess not. Oh, that was an axe. Ooh, okay, pull the lever. God damn. <laughs> and I guess we'll hobble our ass back down to our, um, our shack, yeah? <laughs> Probably use some sleep right now. And uh, maybe a tourniquet. And uh, maybe a less crazy brain would be nice. Oh, it sounds like it's growling now. Are the tentacles still out there? <laughs> We're moving slow as balls now. I mean, oh, understandably, what are those red dots? What are those red dots? Were they always there and I just didn't look up? Oh, beware, tentacle monster. Yeah, I want to get a good close look at these. Even if it takes me <laughs> all day. What is that? <gasps> Excuse me. Also, Lighthouse looks so good. <laughs> this game, very nice looking. Like the water. <sighs> Gorgeous. Oh, one more. Oh. What happens now? now um <gasps> okay now it's the well <gasps> hey what the fuck was that <laughs> okay we're gonna replay it because i want to get a better look at whatever the frick that was at the ending i'm also curious if we could have just gone back to the shack oh yeah get the body and we know the trail we're gonna speed run this bridge yeah i want to see if we could have um potentially gotten consumed by the tentacles i was a little bit too much of a whim to uh, get too close to them. Pretty sure you won't be able to, but I want to get a good look at that creature at the end too because I really feel like it probably would look good if I didn't look away. I'm gonna get scared by the freaking well. <laughs> we get an amazing jump scare waiting for us in front of us and I turn around and get startled by a damn well. <sighs> it's pretty lame, Marlene. Pretty lame. There was something behind the lighthouse there. I did not see that last time. <laughs> that alone made it worth replaying. I think it was what we saw at the ending, too. Alright, day five. Final day yet again. It actually took a while to get back here. <laughs> so we're gonna make it count. We're gonna see all the spooks we can see on this day. Yeah. Okay, brace yourself. <gasps> oh my god! <laughs> Somehow that still got me, even though I was expecting it. I didn't jump, but I did gasp. <laughs> that was very gasp-worthy of a jump scare, but it appears it leaves you alone. No matter how close you get to it. Pretty freaky. Look at them. Thankfully, you cannot fall off the dock, because that would make me cry. I can only imagine what's below the water that we can't see. Right, I guess time to go chop off her leg. And then see what happens. 
creepy <laughs> bird of me. Yes, Master Lighthouse. I shall feed you. The tastiest flesh you will ever experience. <laughs> I have heard once you go human meat, you can't go back. Not that I'd know. And not that I'll ever know. I have zero interest in finding it. <laughs> also, I don't think that's legal. Alright, back down we go. Of your beware. You're in your skin. Let me out. Let me out of this lighthouse. Wait, we didn't pull the freaking lever, goddammit. <laughs> Honestly impressive that this protagonist can do this with a freshly cut off play. <laughs> yeah, I would not be going back upstairs to pull the lever. But maybe I would. I'd be a pretty dedicated lighthouse keeper, pretty sure. Yeah. I'd make sure that shit got done every night. Even if it cost me a limb. Yeah, maybe not if it cost me a limb. Unless I was out there long enough to going fucking crazy. Then who knows what I would do? I don't. <laughs> what am I even saying? <laughs> Some of the things that go through your mind when you uh, are replaying a game for a second time. I think we can just go to our bed. I mean, I kind of want to, but I also kind of don't want to. Because I don't want to miss the scare we replayed the entire game to see. But I'm also just curious if it'll change anything. Okay, good, you can't. I think you have to go to the docks here. Which is fine. It's what I wanted to do anyway. <sighs> the ideal place to bleed out. I mean, if you have to do it anywhere, it's probably the place I'd do it. I wonder if it came out of the water. If it comes out of the water, I don't want to do it. I don't want to see it. Because that freaks me out. Ugh. Ugh. Okay, I think we might have to get up on where we dropped the- Oh, it even has an arrow telling us to. Uh, I didn't see that originally. But alright. Make our slow ass way over there then. Kinda annoyed at myself for wasting time going out over here. Almost there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'd probably go crazy quickly if I were actually a lighthouse keeper. Oh, I don't want to look at the water. I don't want to look at the water. I'm gonna look at the water. There we go. Hand is off the mouse and keyboard. I have no longer control. Whatever happens, happens. I think I have to look around. What? Okay, I think whatever it is, it just sneaks up behind you no matter what you're doing. You just don't get a clear look at it, which once again, based on the quote at the beginning, I think that's what the creator was going for. What scares you most is what you can't see, and your mind does the rest of the work for you. I don't actually remember what the quote was exactly, but I mean, go to the beginning of the video, you'll see it. <laughs> or better yet, I could just restart the game and read it again. The oldest and strongest emotion of mankind is fear, and the oldest and strongest kind of fear is the fear of the unknown. <laughs> there you have it. All right, well, that was The Beacon's End, and I definitely very much enjoyed this one. Love the look of it, love the vibe, love the atmosphere, the ambiance, all very creepy, very good. And I'm always a sucker for a lighthouse setting, especially in a horror game, because it's just such a good setting for it. I mean, it's the perfect place for a main character to go crazy, to you know, hide from their demons, right? <laughs> but yeah, really enjoyed the tentacle jump scare, even though I expected there to be tentacles because, you know, not all, it still got me surprisingly good. And I think at the end, I still wish I could have got a better look at it, but I am not going to play it a third time to see it. Maybe I will later. I don't know. We'll see. But yeah, for now, that's where we're going to end. That was the beacon's end. And as always, let me know what you thought in the comments below. And thank you so much for joining me for this one. I hope you enjoyed the video. And if you did, give it a like if you want to see more like it subscribe. And then I hope to see you in the next one. Bye. Bye.